technically for it in pads. You know, it's not like we're going to start scrimmaging on first day pads. We're in pads. To me, once you get shoulder pads on, we never go to the ground until unless we're scrimmaging. So not much is going to change on a day like today. Uh, day five of training camp. Uh, coming off of, uh, you know, a day off, we should see some good things starting to happen. And, you know, we had our moments on both sides of the ball. Isaiah Williams didn't get a ton of reps today. Is he doing okay physically? Is he injured? He's, we have everybody on the plan. Plan was for him to take less reps today. No issues. We don't have any major injuries right now. So guys are out. It's kind of how we have it kind of scripted right now. Yesterday you mentioned that, you know, the running backs, they're, um, you're really excited about that group. What does maybe Mike Epstein bring to the group and what are you excited to see him do? Well, Mike, he's a complete back to me. He can catch the ball out of the backfield. He can run in between the tackles. He can get outside. Uh, he's a smart player, real good in, you know, block protection. Uh, you know, when, when Mike has been healthy, he's, you know, given us good play and uh, he's a good football player. Tony Adams just seems to be one of those guys that's always around the ball. Just what does that kind of say about his instincts and his, his awareness and what do you think his potential could be with the full offseason knowing that he's going to be playing at the free safety spot this year? Yeah, I, you know, we've got to, we should be saying that about all the defensive back. You have to be able to, you know, have instincts to get to the football. It's always about taking the ball away. Tony is, uh, you know, we talk Tony can play a lot of different positions. Um, in the slot, free safety, both safety positions. Play corner if we really had him to, so uh, we should see that. Next step for him is to start getting more flash plays, more picks, scores, things like that. How valuable is it to have a DB that you could just move around all over the field like that? Well, it, it helps a lot. It helps an awful lot. But, um, you know, first we're trying to get four solid players that can play their position. And then from there, if you have a player with flexibility, one of the things we're trying to do is a big emphasis for us is to add to the depth, and I feel like we're doing it.